All right, last time we uh, finally killed those damn horses and got. Yeah, no, it was last time we got two new party members. Mm -hmm. That was all one video. Wild. Uh, I did one thing off screen, which is I took care of activating Fall. He exists now. Do you want to be sturdy? Yes. Do you want HP, defense, and maybe a little strength? Whereas Bunyan is HP, power, and defense. Bunyan reduces your AP, fall reduces your agility, both reduce intelligence. And it really comes down to which one do you not want to lose. Yes. For someone like Pico, who is slow already, fall's fine. But Fall is a dangerous person to put under someone like Ryu, who wants speed. And it, it can be frustrating trying to get like that happy medium on Ryu of getting all the stuff you want, but not giving up too much in the process. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, that's what my understanding was looking at it. Um, sorry, I'm taking care of one last thing here on the side. Yeah, the, the good thing about Pico is that he is a tank. The bad thing is he's, he's never going to be quick, and he's never going to cast spells well. Whatever. He punched good. That's all yep. I need. I wish I had kept a picture of him, but I had, I got a little bit ahead of where you are, and he is now level like 15 or something, and I still think he has single-digit intelligence. Uh, Durandal is finished, which means that yep. we do actually have to make an effort to finish everyone else. Uh, I wouldn't worry about finishing everyone ever. But, but what if? Yeah. A question from the chat. I thought Gar was the tank. Is the onion also a tank? Gar hits harder than Pico does because Gar gets access to better weapons. They just have more power on them. Uh, Pico is an HP and defense sponge. So he can just sit up on the front lines, absorb tons of hits, and he'll swing back just as hard um, as most other people in the park. Yes. Remember, a caveat is that you can be tanky, but not so much a tank. So the difference here. So. Yeah, just for wording and all that, because there was also something I forgot to do. Uh, a tank mainly soaks up hits. They have, uh, defense is their thing. Gar is a physical attacker. That is Gar's gimmick. You need to have Nina in the party here if you want to make Well, her... piss. Yep. By the way, the faster way to get through this thing is actually to say yes to if someone wants to stud, uh, study with me and then immediately cancel out of that menu so you don't have to go through to the does anyone want to quit out of this thing. But you already said that you weren't going to be a student, so who cares? By the way, uh, this will probably be the party that we're running with this stream for the most part because... Sure. Hey, the ladies got their time in the limelight last stream. The last stream was mostly Nina and Momo. Mm -hmm. And Momo is also supercharged. Yes, Momo is overleveled. No, she's fine. She's just fine. Oh yeah, you can get through this entire game with Pico being level 1. You never have to use him. He is 100% optional. Because the game is kind enough that it's like, hey, you've been leveling all these other guys, gave you this character at level 1 a little bit later in the game than these people. If you don't want to worry about it, don't 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 do it. It's okay. You can you will be just fine. But what if you utilize the onion and obtain true power? Yeah. Put the onion under master that boosts the thing that the onion likes and then suddenly the onion is amazing oh I need to not be playing two playstation yep. era RPGs right next to each other yep so have you put them under any kind of master yet or no? uh, they are both under bunion okay so you already did that gotcha yes also I need to actually sleep in the camp Yes. What other onion starts at level one? The onion. Three, yeah. 
Well, Ryu does too. Oh, right. Our job right now is to go to a tower. Yeah. Have you... I think they said you had to go take Nina back home? Yeah, you need to get permission to travel east, so you need to go back to Windia. Oh, um, remember that place you wandered around that, um, like the forest area to the right of Windia? Yeah. That you saw a bunch of rocks and stuff in? Yeah. Probably want to go back there with Pico now that you have him under a master. Yeah. Yeah, letting the king know his daughter is alive is a good idea. Ah. Uh. Yeah. Good baby. And now it's time for the most important thing here. Fishing. Whoa, right, new rod. There's a mystery fish here. I saw it when I was running around earlier. I also think there are basses, so... Actually, I'll look up what it is. Yeah, because that's, that's, that's a bass right there. Oh, don't worry. My understanding is that the text shit does not matter at all. It, it can actually do things, but it doesn't actually matter. It is fake as hell. Oh, you coward. Right. Not too bad. Well, that's okay. Well, it may be. Uh, okay, we did not actually lose the war, or we did. We're down one more. Okay. Mm -hmm. Reminds me, I should save state. Um, what are we looking for here? It's one of those jellyfish, actually. Ah, wow. Well, there's two different types. We'll go for a further out one. You'll know it when it uh, starts biting. Well, that seems like it might just be a jellyfish. The description for this area, because I didn't do it, and that's why I went, hmm, I might have to stop here on stream, uh, was, there's a weird fish here. Yeah, it says something bizarre is swimming with a fish here. Okay, I think you caught the thing here. Yeah, I don't think so. Does that guy of yours have any hints of where this fish is? I mean, it's in the thing. It's just more a matter of what you need to catch it. That's what I'm looking up right now. Make sure you have to use a certain type of thing. Oh, a new record. Just a worm. I think I found it. They're way out there. Wow, these things are used in nothing important. Okay, good to know. Yeah, they're probably the ones that are swimming less Sideways. like a jellyfish and more like a squid. Oh, yep, yeah. I'm
Oh, you know what you fire. Uh. Maybe you have already caught one of these things. No, it was uh, unmarked. No, oh, gotcha. Oh, you caught the other version of these guys. Which I'm fine with just catching one for now. Just to have yeah. it in my... Actually, you game. should have one of these. And you should always have one of these in your inventory for reasons. Wild. Yep. Some of the mechanics to get certain, like, masters in this game are pretty esoteric, and they don't tell you things until you get there, and it's very annoying to go back and go, oh, I could have just, you know, had that for hours and hours leading up to this point. Good God, you have a lot of points. Martin Squid, 420, nice. Marsha, not... Damn it, Nui. I can never catch another one of those. No. Anyway. I'm just going through. Oh, yeah. I have above average on everything at this point, so I feel oh, pretty yeah. good about that. You've already hit uh, the, the important point on points, so you're good to go. Okay, you say that, but there are higher ranks. There are more oh, levels of fish. What the heck does it do in combat? Uh, blind all enemies. That sounds about right. So, it's useful. Uh, how many levels does Bunyan take? To fully upgrade? Yeah. Ten. That might take a little bit longer than I was thinking. I wouldn't power level him. I just uh, wander around with him in the party. He'll catch up pretty quickly. All right, but... And by wander around, I mean actually do plot stuff and what have you. But if you want to get a couple levels here, that's perfectly fine. Did you equip Pico with anything? Pico can equip things? Oh boy. You want to kill that thunder real fast. M maybe take off reuse Claymore and have him use something a little bit lighter. It's all right. But what if? Yeah, Pico knows absolutely nothing. Ripper. Mm -hmm. Pico can also use the Melted Blade, which is a nice touch. Jack's back. Yeah. Starting Intelligence. Four. Now, I will say, I was spoiled on something. What's that? Oh, how Pico fights? Yes. Okay. Doing the uh, the required fights. Yep. To, you know, he repri he reprisaled once. Huge. Also, he regens. Yes, Pico regenerates five percent of his health. I think every turn. I did not see that yet, though. <laughs> yep, it's great. Who needs other stats? Pico's, uh... Pico's Pico. I'm not gonna spoil it. Oh, hey. Wait, what was it? S? It was like something that started at... Spirit. It's a different type of fishing item. I think it's an upgrade of, like, the worm.
Oh, shit. Uh, uh, so I have one. Okay. Yeah. When you get past a little bit more of a point, uh, Pico can wear that uh, cape that I told you to pick up for Nina and all them. So that's not a bad thing to throw on him to give him a big boost to defenses. He can also wear a breastplate. We're going to buy armor for Pico and Gar. I wouldn't worry about doing it right now. I mean, it takes five seconds, and I'm just going to walk back to the arena town. That's fair. Where you have a massive discount. Exactly. Doubt they'll need too much, really. Does Gar not have a command? Oh, uh, Gar's command isn't... Is, his is kind of like what Ray's was, which oh, is... Situational. pops up in situational things. He doesn't have the bash or the using Ooh. the snap or anything like that. All right, so he can just use Ripper. Yeah, he uses Claws. He already has good armor. Might as well just buy a Breastplate for Pico because who cares? Breastplate, Gauntlet, Blast, Domino. I'll give him a nice little defense boost. His agility doesn't matter. Sorry to spoil it, folks. P Pico is never going to be fast. Never. Why not just a bronze shield instead? Cost more money. I'm not cheap. That's fair. Yeah, that agility of zero, that's not going anywhere, folks. Well, it might for a little bit, but not for long. And I'm sure we'll get a better upgrade for Gar pretty soon, and yeah. Or Spico just had fucking nothing. Yeah. If you want to, you can juggle people's inventories in order to make things a little bit easier with not buying so much stuff, but having everybody at kind of a decent base with a base of equipment and only moving a couple things around makes things a lot easier. We can just you know what? Since you're here, remember that one place where the, the oh. three guys, those three thugs? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, also, you mentioned that farce. Well, do the thugs first. Yes, that was here? Where was that? Oh, it was behind this mountain. That's right. Yes. Now that you have Pico, you can do the thing you need to do here. That's right. Cut down the tree. Something like that. Or the small tree. Big tree. Flower gel. Yeah. Flower jewel. Okay, we're good. That is a key item thing. Vital. Are you sure? I don't it might it might not even be in your inventory. What? Yeah, you picked up those eggs from Rocky. Is there, is there a problem? There it is. Appears valuable. Yeah. Do not sell that. <laughs> oh, these guys are still here. That's fine. That's right. Yeah, Pico can check things. He knows what's up. He knows what the score is. Yeah. Behind that adorable face, eyes of a killer. And also an onion, but mostly a killer. All right, we can talk to a tree. We still can't do anything with flowers. Nope. Where was... That, far. that forest? It's across the bridge to the right. Okay, thank you. I just did not remember that at all. No, that's perfectly fair. A bit of last session is a blur. Yeah. We went a little long, but it was for the best. I think
think you already did this fishing spot. I did. That's where we got the black bass. Mm -hmm. So this place is actually supposed to be the place you can go to to level up Pico after you get him. Because there's a bunch of uh, slimes around, ooze, or goo, that you can beat up. Maybe if I was a coward. Yeah, but don't really need to worry about that. Time to hit some rocks, though. A couple of those rocks, like that rock right there, or Hank hiding things. Hank's rain. Yep. All oh, right, you had the two things on you that will never come off. Yep. Well, you can probably take a talisman off. That's just protection from death attacks, which the light bangle protects you from. Oh, rad. Okay, yeah, alright. Was unaware it went that far. Yeah, it's just straight up protection from status effects. It's okay. You can pick up something else to go there in a bit. The light bangle doesn't give complete protection, it just gives you a very high level of protection. Tight. Run, run, run. What if, though? How hard is it? Save and find out. That's a good way to put it. If Best. you can ascend, now is the time to do it. <laughs> they sure are. Well, best is when you put in your favorites. Oh... It's favorites, not best. Got it. Yes. Mm -hmm. And you can set that up on your menu, but who cares? There you go. Learning to save your MP. You got him. Pico. Good luck, Pico. You're gonna die horribly, but it's fine. Oh, we're fine. So, that was a burn attack that dealt 30 damage to a person who is resistant to fire damage. Notice how that thing dealt two. Oh yes, yeah, like we're definitely. Ha 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 ha! Hello. Yeah. What if they were all just gone? for that one. It is quite the tanky boy. Yeah, it's got about 250 health, I think. I might have been better off using Pico to heal. Yeah, Ryu can take this guy out with an attack on this right next round. Oh, he can't, because the other enemies were slowing down the Goo Titan enough that you could get the extra attack in. But that's not how it worked. Apparently it is, because you didn't get an extra turn that time. I think it averages their speed. Haha! Joy Venus. I figured that the slimes would be casting fire spells, so that's why I turned them into the flame dragon, and that used thorns in order to amplify its attributes. Mm -hmm. He already absorbs fire uh, in base flame dragon form. I believe in base he resists it. If you thorns, he absorbs it. 
Well. Mission accomplished. Is that Shit, one or two levels? Spell. That's only one level. For Ryu? That was just a one. That, though. Yep. Our little onion got way bigger that day. Yes, he did. And now I never have to fight those again. I did it once. <laughs> Notice how he didn't gain any intelligence. He doesn't need it. He's already got 77 health. Oh, man. So, that rock there? Get a running start. Oh. Well, you want that need to go in the lake, I assume. Yep. All right. Well, we will, we will come back to that. Don't much care for uh, when Pico gets in the battle, though. And his mouth gets real big. Yeah, he's terrified. Don't much care for when Pico's preparing to fight. Get used to it. And I wish this was one of those games, though, where you could take out the main character. Yeah. Or, or it's like in the next game where the other characters are in the combat; they're just in the back row, so to speak, and you can flip them in with you if you need them. Or experience was shared. Yeah, that too. Probably gonna be running for most of the fights here. The experience here actually isn't that great. Again, it's you wander around with Pico here for a couple levels right before going to the festival, get him to like level five or six, and you're like, ah, that's close enough. Uh, Jazz asking, why would I want to take Ryu out? Uh, to balance levels a little bit. Ryu is level 17 almost. It's just turned 16. Yeah. Uh, whereas I have a level one, a level 14, no, two level 14 characters now. So, just having him out of the party for a little bit so everybody else's levels could bounce out would be a thing to do. Unfortunately, you can't uh, activate that just yet, but remember that for later. Okay. That is a thing. Um, also, just sometimes it's fun to not have the main character in your party. Yep. Hell, that's why I didn't bring Zidane to the final boss fight of Final Fantasy IX, because the game gave me the option. I was like, hell yeah. I think that's the last thing you needed to pick up in here. Okay, but what if? Okay. Sure. Nah. I'm good. I did it once. Don't want to get over leveled. Is it wrong that you want to punch Pico? Well, in what way? In that you hate him, or he looks kind of like it'd be fun to hit? Like he looks squishy. How many PS1 games have I streamed as of late? Favorite story, oh, Lunar One, Hoshigami, this. Yeah. Uh, Vandal Hearts. Oh, right. I played Vandal Hearts, not Vagrant Story. Similar games, I do that all the time, too. Both Suicune Ends, Final Fantasy IX, though I played the PC version of Final Fantasy IX. Uh, yeah, I played a lot of PlayStation games in my time. Sometimes it's nice to show off those old games. That's a lot of mage. Anyway, time to progress the plot. 
Yes. Let's, uh... That was... The one th oh, wait, though. We did get a level on Ryu. And we are right here. Oh, yeah, sure. I think this is level two on this uh, master. Yeah, and you told so me it was... You're halfway there. Yeah, you told me it was five? Two, three, and four. Okay. So a very fast one. Yes. And then I don't know where we're going to move after that. Hopefully we hit another new master. I was looking a couple things up, and it's unfortunate uh, that Ryu is going to have to spend a couple more levels with this person because the best point to put Ryu on fall is actually from 17 to 20 because he doesn't get any agility from those levels, or he gets very little. There it is. That's the skill I wanted you to give to Pico. So, Monopolize, if I mean, used in combat, yeah, you can look at it. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, yeah, sure. Does that. So, this is how you can keep Ryu at a reasonable level while getting other people up to speed. Interesting. With the unfortunate side effect of you have to use a skill ink every time. To move it around. That's okay. Alright. Story time. Just the sound level. Okay, I did. Game felt a little loud, but I think it's alright. You, you have to have Nina in your party here. That sounds like bullshit. No, that makes sense. Yeah. In fact, this is a weird RPG where your entire party isn't with you at all times. Yeah. Again, that that is something I will hold against this game, where you really should be able to switch your party in a town on the fly. I was trying to figure out what was funnier, walking up with a giant demon or walking up with an onion. Yes. You're right. Just, yes. There's no trees down here that I can punch. I actually thought you were going down there to punch those kids. Nah, I'm fine with those kids. They're just kids. This is, for, this is for making me do dumb hide and seek game. I will punch the quiz master here. I say. The fuck is this? That's the catacombs you came out of. So it is. It's been a bit. Yeah, it's alright. Okay. Don't like that animation for going up the stairs. Not in the slightest. Don't like his running animation, but slowed down. What if I'm, when I'm hopping up the stairs, I go slower? had to hang on that one for a little bit. Dun dun dun. Actually, wait, can we get this dumber?
There you go. Kari is very good at his job, you see. What the, what the, go back up there. Well, I'm exploring. There. I actually uh, never explored this part of town. With the bread factory. Hello, I am the bread inspector. He's using gloves. Oh, this is actually a shop. Do you need bread? Okay. That's that's actually a good joke. <laughs> and of course. Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh. That is a quality youth. I love everything about that building. How much bread how much bread say, you... If you like that building, you'll really like this building. How much do y'all make bread? Nobody needs as much bread. They make food for an entire city here. Via okay. The bread. People cannot sustain themselves solely on bread. Lies. Christ, y'all. This may be going a bit too far. Ah, the secret bread. Nope. M M Mop. Moxa. You know, it's like flatbread. Don't use that. I have no idea what that means, so you got it. Yep. Willpower refers to your ability to get up if you take a lethal hit. Ah, it also guts. plays into a couple of other things. It also might be bugged in this game. I don't remember. The other places are upstairs too, but I don't think I can. Get oh those. yeah, that item finding sound is directly in Capcom's other games. Oh yeah, it's exactly the one from uh, Mega Man Legends. Legends. Yeah. I mean, like air quotes recycling sounds, like fucking whatever. You have your soundboard. I do know that in your party, the person that has the highest willpower is actually uh, Momo. She can uh, take several critical hits or lethal hits and just get right back up. Okay, so yeah, these other buildings did have bread. It's all just bread. No, no, no. I meant they, they have upstairs, but they have no way to access the upstairs. Oh, yes, absolutely. It's only that one. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How does Pico climb ladders? He uses vines. Sure is. Oh. You know, I was kind of fifty fifty on if this would even work, talking to the guard as Nina. Mm-hmm. Oh no, the first time I did it, did this, it took me about 30 minutes to figure out what to do, because I completely forgot to just switch over to her to talk to this guy. I was an idiot.
uh, we were talking about recycling sound effects, and I'm... Isn't it something like the power-up and power-down noise in Mario are the same sound effect, just at different speeds? Alright, hello, six party member. I'm going to guess. You look different enough. I appreciate Ryu slamming his fork on the table. Also note that Gar is not sitting at a chair. He's just standing. He's too big. It's actually uncomfortable for him to sit in a chair. He would break the chair. I mean, it's more like the wings. That too. <laughs> that turkey looks like a butt. Well, I can't not see that now. <laughs> Thanks a bunch. with a save. Yeah, are we even sure Pico eats? Everybody else started eating. Pico probably doesn't need to do that. He just needs to drink some water and stand outside for a little bit and he's fine. Life savings. Correctly doing the right thing. Check that the uh mm, down or door. Which is not sword progression. Well they said what's that sound and it sounds like a plate smashing, so that doesn't where help. they want you to go. Just take the door. Got it. Ah, you got it. Hold up, sword progression. I need to raid the castle of its ge gem rolls. Okay, I found progression. Goodbye, lady. <laughs> Still have wings. Yeah, wings now are very rare. Ah, oh, some that good herb. Oh, 
I want to talk to the person in the bed. I'm trying to figure out how to pronounce that name. Sheila? Oh yeah, there you go. Or Shayla. Probably Sheila though. Alright, who are you? You're a party pooper, that's who you are. Taking dad's herb. Later, dad. Don't mind me, just clean in my armor. As you do. I love Fat Knight though. That axe. It's a pretty good axe. Alright, and then oh, Gold Knight though. Mm -hmm. Gold Knight who extremely just looks like a Gyan. Pretty much. What is going on in the kitchen? Hello, fishman. Trying to make a deal. Hello, provisions man? This is the jail. You're damn right it is. Hey, I, uh, I left something in there. Please? Fine. I will never forget about you, jail chest. If only you could pick a lock. If only Ray wasn't fucking dead. Super dead. Oh, this guy though! Hey Hashio, how you doing? So if you played Breath of Fire 2, you'll remember this jerk. Heckin' Mega Chonker. That was a boss fight. A lot of people hated it. <laughs> oh lord, he's cooking. Hi, hello, we're the two chefs just making our eggs. Next to the pot of stew. There's a lot of meat and vegetables yep. in here for a town that only processes uh, bread. Well, yeah, they're birds. They eat bread. Ah, somebody got into the booze. <laughs> and this guy, who just, you know, took a loaf of bread from the kitchen, came down like here. Like you do. Ah, oh, that drunk got in here again. Pay no attention to the locked door, folks. That'll never be important.
Get him with the old spicy magic on my way out. Yep. Now we check on Lady Who Dropped the Plate? Almost. Okay. Spooky. Ah, yes. Our box chamber. Yeah, that's where we keep the box. This is where we, uh, this is the, the royal box here. Don't think about it too much. Have you tried to see what's inside the box? I hit X multiple times against the box. There's and, nothing in there. Yeah, you cannot inspect this box. That is the royal box. Do not question the royal box. We consult it in times of need. What was up this stairway? Somewhere I hadn't gone yet. The servants' quarters. Gar's a saint. You take that back. Yes! Give me the stories of the old Breath of Fires. Finally, what I'm here for. Books. Pretty much what it's saying is that all the different peoples, their powers have dulled as time has gone on, probably because of intermarrying and such. question with the chat. So were the dragons evil in the first two games? Uh, the first game, yes. Very much. Uh, it was about half and half. There was the light dragon clan and the dark dragon clan and the dark dragon clan was trying to take over the world. And the light dragon clan, which is what Ryu was part of, had lost their ability to turn into dragons. So, yeah. Alright, it's about time. A fucking podium in your kitchen? Yeah, for like bards and such to play on a stage. I suppose. Uh, not up here. Nope. Talk to the guards. Or can I? Which way is that way? moment here. I just got a text message uh, specifically about something for tomorrow. Absolutely. Take your time. 
So while he's looking at that, uh, the dragons in the second game were almost universally good, save for a couple of few uh, unique characters. The second game is also the only game where Ryu actually has a last name. It's Bateson. Uh, that comes up a couple times in the story that he is related to someone whose last name is Bateson. But for the most part, Ryu is just Ryu. Dude turns into dragons. Okay. Oh, I should have talked to that guard to make sure this was the right way. You're, you're going the right way. But what if? Okay. Okay. Problems with tapes. Oh, shoot, I forgot to finish the sentence I was typing. Sorry about that. Yeah, the first thing we did in this game was torch a bunch of miners, but A, we're used acting out of fear at that point, and B, he doesn't know better. Oh, I wonder if it's going downstairs to the mysterious door. That could be true. Too far. Now, where could she be hiding in this isometric game? I'll figure it out. Nope, that's a rat. Good try, though. Obtain cheese. <laughs> oh, I was really hoping you'd find that. Squeak? Squeak! So, th again, this is another point the first time I played it that I got lost forever. If I see them, I kill them. <laughs> the mouse goes running right in front of him. <laughs> well, obviously, it's because he has his eyes closed. Yeah. What's honey? You're fired as a chef. Maybe it doesn't exist in this universe. Don't bees don't exist. Kind of okay with that. Yeah, but also, bees are good. They are. Did it. They kind of made it seem like it wouldn't have gotten past the chef. Mm hmm. But did they? They got past the chef the first time.
Oh no. He's going for the sacred box. Not the sacred box. <sighs> Nobody can touch the sacred box. Box. Just gunning straight for it. That's a sound effect. Yes, it is. Oh no, honey! my timer. Momo, well, you're the worst. You got all the way to camp and went, wait a minute, where's my constant companion that's been my one friend for so many years? Meanwhile, Gar's just gotta feed this fire. Gotta have a nice big bonfire every single night. It was a weird amount of plot that felt unnecessary. The whole thing with Nino running around the castle. Yep. I, I get that they wanted an explanation for her leaving the castle. But, uh, that was a lot of time to do that. <laughs> hey, guess what? Nino just got kidnapped again. Not is it kidnapped when she uh requestingly left? They're gonna think that she was kidnapped. And really, that's all that matters. Also, my party got goofed. Yeah, 
I want you to use this party a whole bunch. Oh my lord. Just hit it. No. That bird could have given you another swallow eye, though. I guess you're right. I should have kept a tally of how many times the game forces a certain party on you. Back to Eggnog Rock. I don't think there's anything here that you haven't seen. I mean, the kind of movies. Yeah, that's a critical hit, all right. Finally, vindication. There it is. Clothes. Are they talking about Tipo? They could be. It was a purple haired kid that went running this way. Hey, look, Nina's back. Yeah, like these guys could stop Gar getting through if they tried. It's a wonder that bridge doesn't just break under the weight of all that badass.
All right, but there were a lot of houses there. Mm-hmm. And now we turn right back around and go check them. All right, I'm going to save you some time. There's nothing on the bridge. That's fair. The checkpoint, though. Mm-hmm. God damn it. You can fix your party later. There's no fights in the checkpoint. Well, I'm already out. Fair enough. Okay, game, if you're not going to let me act like all the party members are there at the same time, then don't force change my party yep. constantly. Yep. No, that is a, a legitimate and very serious problem. You should just be able to switch between all your party members whenever you want to in the dungeon. I forgot that 200 is actually a lot. It's a reasonable amount. I need all this meat. Free items are free items. Okay, Gar really does get caught in a lot of shit. Yes, he does. Joke's on you, I'm doing the bridge anyway. No, but the secret I was trying to keep. It was very short. All right, new zone, new fishing. New places to find. Two new fishing? Oh, wait, I can't get that fishing. Yes, you can. Oh, man. Oh, boy. You might have everything here, though. No. Oh, I'm missing a bunch of stuff. Good ready. Where are there jellyfish here? Hey. I think those are super jellyfish. Alright, well there were octopi, so Hey, you've already caught the octopus. Whoops. I was looking at the octopus and I have a shark. It. Tiny fish, fries I think, might be on the other fries. one. Eat it. No, those are flying fish, so I want the big fish here. Yeah, you already got the flying fish. Ho oh, ho ho. That's a big one. That's all I like to hear. Very good. Ray. Rod Master Double Plus. Four thousand points. Yeah, so you, you want to catch the ones that don't look like uh, octopi or squid. The ones that look ac like actual jellyfish. Good. Ready. 
<laughs> Man of War. All right. There you go. More fishing will be a thing that occurs once. While I... you're there, why don't you go check that beach a little bit more closely? The beach where you were just fishing. Hello. Would not have thought that they would put something that close. Mm hmm. Here I go, the bouncing boy. Hello, fishman. Fish haver. Response to that was just perfect. Yes. Okay. So. He's a master. Okay. Nobody should be a master under him. Nobody? Nobody. Alright, explain why though. He gives a lot of HP and AP, uh -huh. but at the cost of strength defense, agility, and intelligence growth. Alright, does he have any good skills? No. Alright. You're dead to me. Yep. Sorry. Is that the fishing I will look master? up his skills. He is, he is a master. You need In order to have, be a ma or apprentice under him, you need to be a rod master. So you need to have 2,000 points. Whack. Whack. I was looking forward to the fishing master. Sorry. I think his name is Giotto. Sure. Giotto. I'm just gonna look up what he does. So he teaches you Trump, which casts a random spell, Berserk, which raises your power for three turns and then you die, and then Sudden Death, which is Roulette. Those all sound amazing. They're really not. He isn't the worst person ever to put Ryu under, but there's, there's other people that you can get AP on. Besides that guy who's just gonna mess up all your other stats. <laughs> Not intentional going for that one. I know. It was just really funny. I think you've got everything here. Or, did it, or, was, or was there a question No, there, there, there was a question mark. I will not enter unless there's a question mark. Ooh, it's probably this guy. Yeah, it looks like that one. Yep. No, it's kind of a catfish. Sea broom. That was actually literally what I thought it was because it was a red fish. Yeah. Alright. New fish types abound. Mm hmm. Fish on. All right, this house, though. Yeah, let's check out that house. Another useless master. Not useless, just sharply limited in use. Niche. There we go, got it. All trees must be cut. True percent wrong. Hello. Yep, you saw it. <laughs> and this one's a good one. Ah. 
Uh, so I will just ask this ahead of time. What is Reverse of Thunder? Nothing. It, uh, I was going to say, maybe Earth? Yeah, there's no Earth in this. And yet there is a Quake spell. There's no Earth in this. There's no Earth Dragon. There's no trainer here either. Nope. All it is is just a way to get something. Although if you would, go ahead and jump into a random encounter. Because the chat has already brought up a idea. Yeah, chat, please. Don't say things ahead of time. Well, it's mostly the person who said, what happens if you do this? Because I don't think they know. Ho oh, ho, hello. Many strong men await you. Oh, that's a big fight. Yeah, let's do it. So, what happens if we combine the three basics? Trying. Yep. So in this game, uh, every form has a golden version of it, and that is their like the super form of that type. There's the super dragon, which is a trigon, and there's a super whelp form, which you can't make it. I'm gonna assume that we might get like. Oh god, shield is magic. All right, so they're just nope. No, oh, that is no, normal it's, defense. It's physical defense. Luckily, well, you have breath attacks. I have breath weapons. Also known as I don't care. Yeah, so these guys are annoying because they do that. They counter. I have all my breath weapons and then dragon breath. Mm -hmm. Let's see a new breath type. Oh yeah, you know what? Do that thunder breath. Also, very hefty HP total on that trying. Yep. Nice 200 health. So those guys are weak to lightning, so you pick the right element. Yes. Also, hello experience. Yeah, that's another reason why I wanted to get into a fight, was so that he could do that. If you got um, Tipo up to level 14 before losing him, good God, don't ever do that, people. He learns Fire Blast. Now, is that magic or fire? Or physical? That's magic. You haven't ever seen a uh, spellcasting animation either. Hey, that's another good thing to do. Well, never mind. We'll do it eventually. Yep. Is Gar the new Tipo? Gar's the fire version. Tipo knew how to use both fire and frost spells. So Gar's got half of it. Nina's got the other half. Nina has all the frost spell, also all the other spells. Nina has frost magic, wind magic, and lightning magic. And she can also pick up the combo spell of fire and wind. But she doesn't learn the just base fire spells. She has spells. Yes. She's going she to fly. Mage. She's real good at uh, tagging weaknesses, if you know them. It's also made of tissue paper. Can't see it, but I'm bobbing my head like an idiot because this music is way too fucking cheery. Yep. No one can think we don't need a boat. Or medical help. Yeah, this is where you get a shot. <laughs> this is where you go to get shot. Yeah. 
With drugs. With bullets. Uh, we have a flame chrism, yes. Yes, you have that. I think you have a moon sword? I have the claymore. Yeah, you have the claymore, so who cares? Long spear is not a bad pickup. Same thing with the spiked claws. Hmm. You can sell some stuff. Oh, yeah, sure. You don't need to keep all those weapons anymore. I would keep um, a silver dagger, though. And maybe the scrum sex, whatever it is. Well, he currently he just... has that equipped. Oh, he does? Cool. Yeah. Uh, or yeah. not? What the fuck does he have equipped you... right now? No, he has one equipped. You've got two. Oh, okay. We sell one then. Yeah. But yeah, definitely keep that claymore. That thing is getting some use. Yeah, New Newbie actually had quite a bit of money in his inventory. He just couldn't use a lot of it for a while because he had to keep a bunch of dumb weapons on hand. Well, also, you know... Gems. I'm going to say it to make sure I don't do anything by accident. Like sell that flower jewel? Okay, that does sell for a lot. Yes, it does. Do not sell that. <laughs> God, people don't appreciate cheese over here. They're monsters. Man of War gives you one HP. Oh, uh, for people asking in the chat, can you not use the Claymore? We can totally use the Claymore. Uh, Newbie took it off so that Ryu would actually be quick. The, the Claymore is very heavy. But also totally worth it. Get it, because he's a dragon. Yeah. Hello, Buckler. Hello, Night Helm. Night Helm really isn't worth it. Buckler's pretty good, though. Look at that. He's level, what, seven? And he already has that much defense. Yeah, it's only two more. Eh, five for the glass domino isn't really worth it. Yeah. Oh, is he just wearing a bandit? Oh, whatever. He's fine. Yeah, he, he's huge, too. That's a big thing. Yeah. Whatever. I'll hold on to some of that spare equipment just for now. Just in case. Any items? Is a moon Not sword stronger really. than the claymore? No. It's lighter than the claymore. It's kind of like a in-between between the um, sword he's currently using, the Scramasox. Never going to say it right. Scramasox. Which is a dagger. And the claymore, which is a big old honkin'. Yeah, and it also takes off, you know, half of his agility. Yes. Claymore is very, very, very heavy. Very heavy, but he goes very fast. So also, for normal, he hits like a truck with it. Yeah, normal encounters will probably... Hello, Largeman. Uh, normal encounters will probably use the Claymore, but boss fights, uh, maybe we switch to a lighter Something weapon. Something else. You're just an imp. But do you have free items? Maybe. Oh, some of these guys look important. I'll take one, please. Yep. Somebody throw that man through the wall. But he's very important. You should talk to the people down here. Or at least the three guys at that table. 
Okay. As I say, like, I'm not going to talk to everyone. No, just just the, pe- the person who looks different from everybody else. All right, but he still looks mad generic. Eh. He's got a better sprite work than everybody else does. It's a good thing that and... we don't need a we don't need a boat right now. Flag number one. It's a good thing we don't need a boat right now. You sure about that one? We're going to the mountain, aren't we? We're going to the temp the tower, not the mountain. Towers are in mountains. Sure. Stairways are hard. They really are. I want to give you flack for it, but I can't. This frog is amazing. You know, I might split a video right here before we end to this. Because this feels That's like good. this might be a long, protracted thing. Yep. 